Hey guys, Pablo here, and welcome to another amazing project through which uh, you can make a good profit by simply holding the token and you will be earning rewards. It's called the token. Now, the name actually comes if you cannot recognize the dog because there's basically a lot of breeds of dogs. Uh, this one is basically the one of the oldest of the Japanese uh, splits breed uh, that's called the Hokkaido Ken and by you know uh, abbreviating that name it becomes do ken uh, hokkaido and ken so do ken um, that's where the name actually came from so in this project you will be making by simply holding the tokens you will be earning rewards and you'll be earning those you'll be getting reflection in the form of busd binance us dollar that has basically it's equivalent to the uh, american us dollar same prices there so uh, that's that's uh, the main thing of this project. We're going to get into more details and more st statistical analysis uh, about this project. But anything I say in this video about this project is not going to be an investment or a financial advice. So you just keep that in mind that it's entirely up to you if you want to invest in this project or not. And with this being said, let's take a look at the entire project. Now, here I am at the um, token exchange the basically the dashboard and we'll be getting all the information from here here's the tokenomics but we're going to talk about the introduction first it says welcome to token a token where you can just simply hold or hold that means like keep holding for a longer period of time and earn rewards so it says we are not just another meme token we are dedicating this project to reward our holders with a massive eight percent busd reflection 8% is a pretty huge and a generous amount to give to the holders. As we are also have utility token, we keep developing this platform and implementing a new use case of token to our platform. So um, this is not just like an ordinary and traditional meme token. Uh, it is going to have use cases, different utilities to develop it further, to empower it even further. Um, and because of those use cases, because of the utilities, the token will be utilized more. And on every single transaction, uh, more transaction that, you know, happens, the more rewards we will be making. So currently the undistributed rewards is 705 point something BUSD. This is what we are about to distribute to our holders. Um, in these cases, when you hold a token and you get a reflection in other token, basically it's not given out like instantly, like in some project it is, I'm not certain about those, but it, usually whenever this happens, on every single transaction that a person days that is given to the holders is not given instantly. Um, it is first swapped to the token. In this case, it'll be BUSD. And that BUSD basically is um, kept in a pool. And when it's filled, the divines are given out to the holders whenever it can be given out because obviously it depends on the portion that people are actually holding. So whenever they have it ready, it's mostly 30 minutes to one hour when it's like the rewards are given. Uh, they have currently distributed 39, so almost like 40,000 BUSD um, to the people. So you can see they already have given out like a decent amount to the holders already. Uh, you can connect your wallet, you can claim them. I think it'll be uh, you will be manually claiming that here. If not, then it will be done automatically too. But even if it can be done automatically, you still are going to have an option to claim it automatically. All you have to do is simply connect your wallet. You'll see how much you can claim and you can simply claim with just simple clicks. Uh, total paid rewards. So you can take a look at like the total amount of profit that you actually have made, total rewards that you actually have made from there through this dashboard. It says we create tokenomics that people understand. You simply hold token and we reward you in BUSD just like leaving money in a bank but better because in this case you're not just leaving it in a bank but you'll be rewarded for keeping it in the bank to claim your rewards connect your wallet by clicking the button below and then click claim rewards okay so you are going to claim it auto you know manually by connecting your wallet and then clicking the claim button now here's their tokenomics or as they're calling it the tokenomics eight percent is used for BUSD reflection. Uh, we will distribute 8% of every transaction to our BUSD reward pool, which later being used for rewards distribution to every holder depends on their holding percentage on the pool, which is obvious. And 2% is automatically added to the liquidity pool, which, you know, sets a decent and a solid 
price floor uh, and it solidifies the token, 1% will be used for buyback and burn. This tax is collected for buyback in case we need some push to the market and hope that by doing a buyback, we can restore some position when we're facing a downtrend market, um, which is really important in these kind of tokens because you never know what the market like currently is performing really good for some time now, but you never know. So anytime it happens, it's always good to have some measures uh, to like a def some defensive measures to keep the token up, which is this buyback and burn will be used for. And then marketing and development, which is 5%. So they're going to use all this. 3% uh, goes to the marketing wallet and 2% goes to development wallet through which they will be um, doing all the development of different projects, all these use cases, all these utilities that will be from happening from this. And the marketing is basically to get more exposure for this project, all the ads and stuff. So this is basically how it's distributed. It says we are also implementing 1% max buy transaction. So there is going to be a limit to ensure that not a lot of like tokens are bought and sold to yeah, this is basically the anti dump measure that you cannot you cannot like sell um, more than one person of the total supply and additional three percent fees on selling those. so this will be kind of like penalizing people from like selling because there will be an extra three percent on selling and it'll be incentivizing people for holding because they will be probably adding three percent maybe in bsu reflection or adding it in the liquidity pool or in the buyback where i'm not certain but it'll be somewhere there now uh, they're explaining what is token which I already have explained where this name came from um, basically it's a dividend hub um, you will be um, like making rewards in this uh, anytime a transaction happens eight person is used to stop to get BUSD they're come like kind of like put into a pool the and then the dividends are given to the holders there's a limit um, as they're saying they're saying limit swap, set your limit and leave it. This would all, uh, be also token next plan for product development. We understand that not all of us have time to monitor all token that we're invested. So in that case, we want to build uh, we want to build an order limit swap where you can make your order and just leave the rest to token. So basically, in this case, um, for example, if you're not like taking a look at all the prices and fluctuations fluctuations in there, but you do have a plan that. Um, you're going to buy this amount of tokens when it when the token reaches at this price which will be like lower so because you want to buy it at a lower price so um, you basically put a limit order on a buying on a specific amount of like price so when the uh, price is dropped to that amount uh, that transaction is basically initiated automatically you don't have to do that it'll be done automatically and you buy the tokens at that stage so they will be putting that, you know, develop, they're developing that option, which is really amazing. Unified tools, uh, find what you want to see. We'd like to make token to become a place where you can search any token in an ease and see details, information about the token, such as the honeypot check status, who is the owner and other analytics stuff you want to see in one place. So that's going to be another thing in this project that will be developed and independent nodes and resources developing the apps easier. We understand that our biggest issue on the DApps development right now is about the data availability. It's very hard for beginner developer or even pro developer to obtain and query big data on the blockchain. In that case, we're planning to build our own nodes and resource and expose whether API, uh, API or GraphQL endpoint to public that we will believe that we believe will make the apps development easier for other developers. So this is basically for the developers that they're going to make it a lot easier for them, uh, but that may not be something that we us you know the non-technical persons can uh, understand because we don't really ha have an idea about the, all those developer stuff now this basically looks like their roadmap which is something that we're going to take a look at right now um this is the team wallet token holding all the team like how much they're holding basically it's completely transparent you can take a look at all these things and i must say the entire website is well developed it's really awesome you basically have so much information and details and all the, all the information is basically necessary now here's the distribution of the total supply. So 80% supply allocated to pre-sale and liquidity, 70% supply burned to eternal flame, and 30% supply distributed to team wallet, which is completely transparent because we know how much amount they're actually holding and all that stuff. Now taking a look at the roadmap to see what they plan on doing in the future. Initiation, website launch, CMS before and after launch, um, 
uh, Telegram pin in various Telegram channels regarding whitelist, Twitter, Reddit, account setup, pre-sale and token listing, and then spread existence. AMAs with focus Telegram and Discord groups, YouTube influencer promotion pre and post launch, pinned on various Telegram influencer investors group at launch, pinned on 42 TSM Moon group with auto shilling uh, bought every 15 minutes on 42 group, page shillers, uh, and then in on launch, uh, token swap is ready, token reward dashboard, post launch, high priority, dividend hub development, uh, swap engine and swap list data seed, improvement, build your own APIs, so that's for the developer that we just read about, um, and then other plan is there, the order limit swap that we just like talked about, and then the token listing directory, adding more analytics insight on swap page, voting feature on the swap page, you can take a look at it in more details, but I'm not going to go into that like right now. But basically, this is like the entire information. Um, you clearly can see all the information that's like right here. Uh, their mark, what is their market cap? It is currently not a lot. Uh, 635 is increasing like with a really good pace. It'll be going in millions. So I was just to get that before it reaches the million, you know, figure, you have bought these tokens. And I think you can make excellent profit through this. The liquidity is 159.23 BNB. Liquidity is what enables you to buy and sell with BNB. So they have a decent amount of BNB and they have burned uh, this amount of tokens. So um, yeah, so basically this is the entire information that I have for you guys in this amazing project. Disclaimer, trading digital assets involves significant risk and can result in the loss of your invested capital. You should ensure that you fully understand the risk involved and take into consideration your level of experience, investment objectives, and seek independent financial advice if necessary. It is up to you if you want to invest in this project or not. If there's something you don't know, please do not hesitate to ask me. So guys, I'm going to put all the links in the description. Make sure that you check it out from there and make sure that you subscribe to my channel. And with this being said, I'm going to see you in the next video very shortly, so stay tuned.